Hello everybody and welcome back to another Squeak Tech development log where today I'll be showcasing off some pretty cool advanced audio features, so stay tuned. For those new to the channel, I'm developing an engine to create a series of games set in a dystopian universe of mice engulfed in civil war. You can buy the first game in this series right now where you're employed as a hospital desk worker during wartime. Link is below. Alright, so I've got a simple scene set up here. Nothing too special, just want to show off the audio in different environments. So, yeah. First thing you'll notice is I am in the Unity editor for this one. Normally I'm just in Squeak Deck, but the audio is still a work in progress, so some of it I have to modify while I'm recording. So, yeah. Let's turn on the radio. So there it is, little uh, radio player. Playing a pretty good song. Nice. So you got the basics, you run away from it, gets quieter, you know, the obvious things. So let's hop into the more advanced stuff. So we've got some walls here, so the thin walls into the thick walls. So if I stand right here and put it through, it muffles automatically. And then in thinner walls, the effect is less exaggerated. Nice. So, you know, you got a ruckus going on in another room, it'll sound super muffled, you gotta really press your ear up to hear it, things like that. All automated, all of this is baked into the engine, so using this you won't have to worry about any of the logistical stuff, it'll just sound good, it'll just be all ready. So yeah, that's muffling, and that works for anything, so let me find another sound effect. Let's use a gunshot. So you hear that in another room, you're like, whoa, what was that? Or if it happened right next to you. Yeah, it's right there. You can hear it, obviously. Uh, let's put that back and let's get the radio again. Which song were we using? Was it Upswing? Yeah, it was. Let's use Ballroom. Let's change it up. Also, you might have noticed uh, Gunshot Stolen. Yeah, that's the terminology I use when I download this sound effect online and I need to replace it. So, yeah, that one I still need to replace with my own sound. There we go. That's Ballroom. Nice. Okay, so let's keep moving. Let's keep showing off some new things. So let's bring the radio over here. Let me set that. There we go. Next thing I'll show off is, you know, let's say you get bonked over the head and you're not feeling so good. You're concussed for a few seconds. Oh, oh man, I'm not feeling so good. So that'll be in the game. That's all automatically set up. Well, not automatically yet. Of course, I have to manually do it, but yeah, soon enough. Um, and then another cool one is time scale. So I'm going to press a hot key to slowly put down the time. So you'll hear that as I run by the radio. Let me just put it up here. There we go. And okay, I'm going to activate it. There we go. Slow motion. And let me put it back up. Yeah, so that's all integrated, fully done, fully working. You don't have to worry about any of that. Um, let me see. And last one is... Okay, yeah. So here is... Let's pretend this is a sewer pipe. Let's put the radio in the sewer pipe. And let's hop in with it. Whoops. There we go. Ah, let me play it again. So here I am in a sewer pipe, and... Super echoey, you know, there's metal all around you, it just keeps reverberating. Oh, my eardrums. Yeah, nice. Let's bring it back out, and let's go to it. So yeah, that's everything I'll show up for, with audio for now. Of course, all this is a work in progress, it'll all be automated completely by the time you're using the engine. And yeah, all these cool effects will just be baked right into the engine. So I hope you guys liked it, um, that's everything I'll show off for now, make sure to smash that like button, make sure to join the discord and comment below on features you want to see or you want included. Yeah, yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time, see ya.